Hello, my name is Spring, and I'm a mom who loves le reading to my children. Today I'm going to read Click, Clack, Moo, Cows That Type by Doreen Cronin, pictures by Betsy Lewin. I particularly like this book because it um, gives a flavor of what farm life could be like if we let animals decide. Farmer Brown has a problem. His cows like to type. All day long he hears, click, clack, moo, click, clack, moo, clickety, clack, moo. At first he couldn't believe his ears. Cows that type? Impossible. Click, clack, moo, click, clack, moo, clickety, clack, moo. Then he couldn't believe his eyes. Dear Farmer Brown, the barn is very cold at night. We'd like some electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. It was bad enough the cows had found the old typewriter in the barn, but now they wanted electric blankets? No way, said Farmer Brown. No electric blankets. So the cows went on strike. They left a note on the barn door. Sorry, we're closed. No milk today. No milk today, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he could hear the cows busy at work. Click, click, moo, click, click, moo, clickety, click, moo. The next day, he got another note. Dear Farmer Brown, the hens are cold too. They'd like electric blankets. Sincerely, the cows. The cows were growing impatient with the farmer. They left a new note on the barn door. No eggs, cried Farmer Brown. In the background, he heard them click, clack, moo, click, clack, moo, clickety, clack, moo. Cows that type, hens on strike, who ever heard of such a thing? How can I run a farm with no milk and no eggs? Farmer Brown was furious. Farmer Brown got out his own typewriter. Dear cows and hens, there will be no electric blankets. You are cows and hens. I demand milk and eggs. Sincerely, Farmer Brown. Duck was a neutral party, so he brought the ultimatum to the cows. The cows held an emergency meeting. All the animals gathered around the barn to snoop, but none of them could understand Moo. All night long, Farmer Brown waited for an answer. Duck knocked on the door early the next morning. He handed Farmer Brown a note. Dear Farmer Brown, we will exchange all typewriter for electric blankets. Leave them outside the barn door, and we will send Duck over with a typewriter. Sincerely, the cows. Farmer Brown decided this was a good deal. He left the blankets next to the barn door and waited for Duck to come with the typewriter. The next morning he got a note. Dear Farmer Brown, the pond is quite boring. We'd like a diving board. Sincerely, the ducks. Click, clack, quack. Click, clack, quack. Clickety, clack, quack. I hope you enjoyed this story as much as my kids do. Have a blessed evening.